A new vehicle has been dripped into GTA Online. There's also information about the next quote-unquote update coming in a few weeks from now. Casino stuff and more, plus PlayStation 4 and Xbox One players no longer have access to the Rockstar Editor. That was talked about some time ago on the channel, as well as by Rockstar. So if you're wondering where Rockstar Editor went, it's gone officially on last-gen consoles in order to ensure that players in GT Online on last gen are able to continue receiving updates. That's according to Rockstar Games. The new car is the Declasse Impaler SZ. It is about $1.3 million in case you are interested in purchasing this car. I believe you're going to be able to use it for the uh, new drag racings that they added a few weeks ago. So if you like the look of the car, then you got 1.3 mil. Well, plus all the uh, upgrades you're gonna have to uh, do. Then the Impaler SC might just be for you. A new opportunity featuring uh, Vincent, who's now a police officer. Before that, he worked uh, at the casino before he got screwed over. Then he was a security guard at the Rockford Hills Mall. Now he's a cop, and apparently he's gonna be enlisting our help in a few weeks from now in order to bring down corruption and it's not really an update because it's already in the game but rockstar is billing this as an update so it's very similar to drug wars 2 where it was already part of the drug wars but it just gets dripped out months later and that's exactly what they're doing here with vincent and the uh, hellfire interceptor so the uh, gauntlet hellfire interceptor was briefly featured in the GTA 6 trailer and we're gonna be able to get this particular police car along with this new opportunity with Vincent in a few weeks from now and it's gonna be a very expensive car but if you like the other cars that have come out that are police themed you will most likely want to pick up the new gauntlet Hellfire Interceptor as well whenever it arrives in a few weeks from now along with uh, Officer Vincent and his new mission. Meanwhile his uh, former backstabbing employer is offering you double money for casino mission bonuses. It's also uh, triple money, triple RP for the Diamond Adversary series. Target vehicles for the salvage yard robbery include the Buffalo EVX, IC Rally, and the Declassy Mamba. Over at Luxury Auto Showroom FR36, and a, I guess a modded version of the Impaler SZ, a bit more expensive than 1.3 million, by the way will be available for you to purchase at Luxury Auto showrooms. Meanwhile, down the street over at Premium Deluxe Motorsport, Simeon has uh, got on the uh, showroom floor of the Paragon R, Zion Classic, Neo, Peyote Gasser, and the Helion SUV. Update regarding voice chat. Since the release of Chop Shop, default setting for voice chat in GTA Online is now set to off. You can change your preference in the settings section of the pause menu. Part of the recent update, they've also added a PS4, Xbox One to the testing of voice chat moderation along with the PS5, Xbox Series, XS, and PC. And if you want to read more about that, uh, come to this article, link below in the description section, and uh, click the link right here. And finally, the discounts, the uh, penthouse decorations at the casino store, 30% off, as well as all the vehicles at Simeon's dealership, 30% off for the Paragon R, Hellion, Zion Classic, and Peyote Gasser. And if you're looking for the Railgun, I believe it is available once more at the Gun Van. Overall, not much really going on this week in GTA Online, but in a few weeks from now, the new Vincent mission might be interesting. At the very least, we're finally going to be getting our hands on the Gauntlet Hellfire Interceptor, and I'm very excited to add that squad car to my collection. Article link below once again in the description section. Thoughts, views, opinions, welcome as always below in the comment section.